What is up my good people? My name is Pixel Love and we are back again with another episode of Amori. In the last episode, I somehow managed to blow through almost 40 to 50k worth of clans! And I am broke as shit now. I thought I was going to be investing in the money of the future, but apparently... It's just as worthless as crypto. I should I should have known. I should have known. But we managed to get everyone. We managed to get Aubrey, Hero. We got everyone out. Mr. Jossum, you know, he was kind of being a little bit of a prick, but at least he understood. So now we're going to try looking for Basil somewhere around here within the last resort. Or I guess mostly the deep well, because we tried, we tried to talk with the people of last resort, but apparently we just... <laughs> There, there wasn't a drawing that uh, there wasn't really a drawing that we could really, that we could really show people. What's up, my guy? You really have three friends? Hmm. All right, all right. Let's get a move on, people. Cool. I didn't have to pay anything at all. Oh, I see the S. I see the S. The underwater highway. All right. Is there a way I can manage to get clams? Actually, before we do this, I need to I need to wait for Pluto. <laughs> All right, Pluto. To this day, Kel still hasn't figured out a way to get on Pluto correctly. But I need to go back to the vast forest. And what I want to try doing is trying to see if I need to water Basil's plants. I do need to water his plants. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I got you. I got you, plants. I got you. Don't worry. Omori's here with the water. You guys are gonna be okay. You know, it's not even giving me any hearts. It's not giving me any experience or whatnot. But like, I just, I, I just need to keep these these plants up. You know, they're for my they're for my buddy Basil, my buddy, my pal, <laughs> my friend. I don't want I don't want him uh, to come back over here just to find out that all his plants are dead. No. Oh, I wanna. Oh, would you look at that? I finally gained a heart. I want to make sure he comes back with everything, you know, back to the way it was. Hopefully. You know, something that I also just realized is technically I I should be able to regain my clams uh really quickly. Due to the fact that, uh, I basically, I basically, uh, have the clam coin, which basically makes me earn more clams. But can you really blame me for trying to think that the game will just be like, yeah, your clams are fucking useless. Come on now. Give me a bit of slack here. Alright, I think we managed to water every single plant that needed water for basil. That's, that's good, that's good. Now, I'm going- since I'm already here and out and about, I might as well just go through the entirety of, well, the map. Just to find out if there's any places that I can go to now that I'm able to swim. Like the Frozen Lake, for example. Or that one place by Firefly Forest, uh, near the bear. So, I will be right back. Alright, let's try- Let's try, let's try doing this. Actually, wait, no, 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 no. I really have 66 clans. All right, all right. Let's see if this one joke is going to help. I doubt it will, but you know what? It's worth a shot. All right, Weeping Willow. Read them and weep them. Joke book, joke book, joke book. Yes, sir. Ocean joke. What lies at the bottom of the ocean and twitches? A nervous wreck. <laughs> oh my god. He's still crying. Alright, worth a shot, worth a shot. There it goes. And of my 66 clans! Oh. <laughs> Alright. What do we have over here? I'm finally over here, back in the Pyrefly Forest. Now, where can I go? What is this? Oh, damn. A golden hero sandwich. <laughs> Please don't tell me that the... Don't tell me that the password is hero. Oh, hey! It's this place! You guys want to get in? 
But Mr. Jossum told me the password once so I could complete one of his errands. I love these guys. They're loads of fun. Uh, alright. What's the password? Hey, Hoagie! It's me, Hero. The password is... Hero, my man. Welcome, welcome. Doors unlocked. Come right on in. Wow! <laughs> what do we have here? Make yourselves at home, kiddos. Any friend of Hero is a friend of mine. Oh my god, it's Rose again! It's you four again! Haven't you ruined my life enough times? Thanks to you, Sweetheart is nowhere to be found. I hope you're happy with yourselves. Help! I don't know what to do! My man is lost. Can't serve fruit juice to minors. You know the rules. But you're always welcome to sing and enjoy the music. Damn, so is, is this what- <laughs> Oh my god, kill with the box. Is this basically what this entire place was? All the times? If I just need to ask for a password, I, there's just a club over here? I feel like I need to go look for- I feel like I need to look around everywhere. Everyone gained five juice! Neat! Well, at least that was cool to know. Although, it wasn't really that use useful. Alright, if you're wondering what I'm doing here in the Orange Oasis, I'm just mostly here to like, try to farm up a few more clams. I'm already near 7k. And these guys have also been getting some big XP over here. But I did manage to pick up this one thing. I managed to pick up this ancient code. Now, I don't exactly remember if I picked up the ancient code prior. But it was the first thing I picked up after I killed all the enemies on the first floor. So, and I could immediately go on to the second floor. So does this mean the same thing? No, it needs a pyramid key. Then... Then what was the ancient code about? What is this ancient code? Alright, pyramid key you say? Well... And... No pyramid key. Cool. Well... I'm gonna keep trying. <laughs> I'm gonna keep trying! Hey, what's up with my guy over here? Mr. Outback has been turned into sand. Uh... Why? <laughs> what happened to him? Did he really stay out in the sun for that long? Oh man! <laughs> Poor dude! Oh! 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 I got a pyramid key! I got a pyramid key! No, not that one. No! No! <laughs> important! 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 Pyramid key. I got another pyramid key! Yo! Let's go! I'm on the third floor! It only took me how long? I wish I could tell you. Oh. Uh... <laughs> uh... What? A rabbit? What the hell is that? Uh... I... I didn't plan for this. I genuinely did not plan for this. Let's give him a little bit of a stare. There we go. I really hope he just doesn't destroy me. Okay, that's not as bad as I thought. 95 straight in the heart. Oh, but this guy has... Alright. <laughs> Alright, this guy has quite a lot of health. So I guess I need to take care of him as quickly as possible. Ow. That, um... Really don't like that. Really don't like that, Chief. Okay, he's almost dead. He's almost dead. Uh, fuck it. Just give him another power hit. Another ricochet. I have more than enough smoothies to to bring bring me back up. Bring me back up. All right, there goes the rabbit. Now, how much XP and clams are we talking about? Five thousand XP, one thousand five hundred clams. Not bad. And there's another one right next to it. Ooh. My god, this man has so much fucking health. Alright, come on, Aubrey. Come on, finish him off, finish him off, finish him off. Yeah, let's go. 
my lord, I need, I, I, I need to, <laughs> I, I need to bring up the juice department over here. What do we have over here? Uh, I don't want to use those melon smoothies yet. I could go with this one. But the two who really need it the most are Omori and Kel. Thank you very much. I very much enjoy your uh, peach soda. What I don't enjoy is our fighting these goddamn rabbits. And I forgot to heal myself! Crap! Alright, the real question is how can I fight these turkeys? Got him, got him, got him. Or chickens, whatever. My bad. Uh, I, I, you know the drill. You know the drill. I don't think it's necessary for me to, for, for me to heal up anyone at the moment. I just need to take these guys down immediately. Well, that chicken is toast. All right, buddy. You asked for it. Actually, did you really? I don't think he really asked for it. He just kind of got owned, if I'm being completely honest. Just like right now. Yep, and he's gone. And he's gone. I don't know what his attack is, and you know what? I kind of don't want to try it out right now. Like, God damn. Where the hell am I going to get another pyramid key? Can I get this one? My spoon is almost about to break. And get a key. Can I get a key? Oh my god, this last one has to break it. The X? The X? The X is here this entire time? At the end of a map in a field of white snow. Where's the W then? I need the W! Uh, Pyramid King? A thank you, fossil. Really? What the fuck is that? Thank you, fossil. A fossilized thank you. Can I please get the pyramid key? Oh, oh. You're kidding me. Do I at least get to keep the the pyramid key? No. Shit. Oh wait, no, I do. I do. Ooh. Might be my way to cheese through it. I might have to cheese through this place since I have the other di since I have the other pyramid key. You just go through it immediately without having to use up any extra extra spoon thingamajigs. God damn, it's gonna take me a, a really long time just to go and attack everyone, defeat everyone again. I was. I was thinking to myself, you know, I have more than enough clams. Because I do. I have 32 <laughs> clams. Okay, I didn't realize I had that many clams. The last time I checked, I was like around near 20k, but 32k? That's pretty dope. But the real thing is that everyone's pretty sauced up, pretty leveled up. The question now is, how far can I get into Dino's Dig? Because that's what I want to know. I want to. I need to know... What's at the final end of this goddamn puzzle? Alright, Dino. I know all I know all your rules. And also jokes on you. I have been grinding out your enemies over here. So much so that I have more than enough clams and more than enough XP. Would you look at that? I can go through it right away. Let's go! Now I just need to find more pyramid keys! Oh! Oh! I got I got the other pyramid key! What do we have over here? A chicken? Really? That's it? Just one measly chicken? Alright, he just runs away. Damn it! Which one do I choose? Oh, uh, oh! Uh. No! Oh! 
Oh, well, at least I managed to make it all the way to the, to the peak. But I feel like there was something up there that I could have gotten. God damn it. And I only have nine dino dollars. I don't have any more silver spoons, do I? Uh, important. Silver spoons? No, I don't. I absolutely do not have any more silver spoons. Well, I, I call it a day for Dino's Dig over there. Because not gonna lie, I've been in there for quite some time. The fact that I'm already about to be level 30 with all of these guys, just, hmm. It's quite a lot of time that I've already spent. Pluto. Come out, come out, wherever you... Oh, they're still looking for Pluto? But me and my dudes decided to look out for Captain Space Boy's Lost Planet Pluto. My guy! Pl Pluto's gone! Pluto's gone! There's nothing you could do about it. Alright, which... Which were the people who wanted to get a cool little thank you gift? Wait a minute. I have the fossilized thank you. I could just give it to them, right? Here you go. No, not you. Here, here. Miss Palmy has been taking care of us forever. She's always been so loving and caring. Wish I could give her something super special. Wow! Is that a thank you fossil? Yes, sir, indeed. I got a thank you fossil uh, earlier. I don't recall if I recorded it or not, but it's just basically a fossil that says thank you. Never seen one of those before. That would make the perfect gift for Miss Palmy. Here you go. You're giving this to me? Wow, thank you. I found this in the fireplace earlier. Maybe you can use it. A snow cone ticket. I'll take it. <laughs> Miss Pommy will be so surprised when I give her this thank you fossil. Alright, did she give it to you yet? Peanut and Jelly are always giving me the strangest gifts. I wonder what they have for me this time. Well, I gave my guy over here a thank you fossil, so... Are you walking to her right now? Mr. AI? AI, are you gonna walk to her right now? No. Well, I at least got that mission right out of the park. Technically, that was the only real reason why I went to Dino's Dig. I was curious as to what was on top. On the absolute top, which was Jack. And I also needed to figure out what to give that little girl for her thank you gift. What was the things that I ended up getting anyways? A bunch of stuff. Whole pizza, snow cone, I'll make sure to get that. Dino clumps. 250 heart, dino pasta. It's pretty good actually. But I'm not gonna lie. At the end of the day, Dino's Dig was hella underwhelming. The only real reason why I came back here, if I'm being completely honest, was really just to grind out. Because my god, do they have some tough enemies in there. I am <laughs> almost 46k clams. And, well, as you can see, I'm almost at level 49 for some of these guys. Uh, faux fact. Yeah, not gonna lie, these guys were... These guys were hella, uh, fucking tough. Especially the first time I came around. Bun Bunny, like, SS Snake, Porcupine, Sprout Bunny, Cilantro, Ginger, Celery. These guys, they, they just kept, kept, kept kicking my ass. But eventually, I was able to beat them, and all of a sudden, I now have to deal with the likes of rabbit and chicken. But it seems like I'm close to finishing up these full effects or whatnot. What I don't like is how these two are just empty right after the King Crawler. What other enemies were there after the King Crawler? I just went straight into Sprawlmo Village! What? None of it makes any sense. And where are these three after them? What, what, are, where are they? Don't tell me it's a... Uh... God damn it, expanded Pluto. The astonishing, glorious expanded version of Pluto. The strongest planet in all the cosmos in the universe. Don't tell me these three are also within the orange oasis and I just haven't found out about them. Whatever. Alright, I am back. Now, 
Not gonna lie, uh, I went through Dino Stakes a few more times because I was thinking, you know what, let me just stock up on some pyramid keys in case I ever need to go to the fourth floor just right away. But I just really got lazy and just decided to fuck off. Uh, particularly because, well, uh, <laughs> I believe I've maxed everyone out. So, and you can also see that uh, I don't have as many clams as I once did. Uh, mostly because I just went ahead and bought a few items. It's mostly, um, I did get some jacks, some rubber bands, but I mostly just got these items for, uh, emotions. Oh my god, I completely forgot that I have this many pearls. I need to sell them ASAP. But, I, I just decided, you know what, fuck it. Let me just get, like, as many of these emotions things or whatnot. Because I'm, the more and more I'm playing, the more I'm starting to realize how much I really should be using more emotions. Especially considering how fucking broken they are. And not only that, but I think I may have developed a strategy in which I'm able to just basically instant one-shot anyone. In theory, in theory, in theory. Um, I decided for Omori, you know, uh, I, don't, I really don't need any more clams at this point in time. If I need clams, I, I could just put on back the clam coin, but for the time being, I think it's better for me to keep the seer goggles. You know, I I value the luck just a little bit more than the defense and increasing the hit rate. Ooh, baby, you know, if if I'm gonna have Omori be manic or whatnot, then, you know, I, I gotta have that hit rate up. And then for Aubrey, um, keeping the body pillow, everything else, in my opinion, kind of sucks. Even the Common Hammer, even the Sweetheart Bus, they all kind of suck in comparison to this. Mostly because, like, uh, this one gives, like, quite a bit of speed. If I remember correctly, right? Actually, no. Whatever. It's 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 still the best uh, weapon, in my opinion. And uh, I actually have the punching bag, which actually doesn't increase any stats or whatnot. Where the hell is it? It should be... What? Uh, it's... Oh, never mind. It's right here. Basically, Aubrey starts off angry every single time uh, we start a battle. And you'll see you'll see why in a moment. Uh, for Kel, keeping the coconut, you know, I value the juice immensely. Also, good old Hector Jr., can't get rid of that for him. And for Hero, I got on the frying pan. I decided to fuck off with the teapot, even though I did say I value the juice. With Hero, it's not so... the juice isn't as important with him. Yes, he is my healer and whatnot, but... You know, it doesn't require that money juice. And cell phone, he has terrible speed, there's nothing I can do about it. So might as well make him the most beefiest guy in terms of defense. And also his frying pan will restore more heart for battle. Oh yeah, and that also reminds me, I changed everyone's skills. So I decided, you know what, fuck, fuck off with the guard. I know I said I, I value the guard, but you know what, at this point in time in the game, the guard is kind of useless to me. You know, the best defense is a good offense. So with Amori, I got Stare, I'm keeping Monk, just because I know I'm gonna make more people angry when I- I'm, I have Exploit, which deals damage to anyone who's happy, sad, or angry, so if Monk don't work, Exploit will, and Final Strike. Basically, if I wanna have Amori be furious, manic, or miserable, then I will be able to capitalize on this immediately. With Aubrey, gotta keep pep talk, you know, gotta make my foes happy. Headbutt, you know the drill. Power hit, pr pr pretty fucking standard. And last resort, this, this is the thing that's gonna one shot. Trust me, you'll see in a minute. You know, with Kel, we gotta keep annoyed, you know, gotta make people angry. I'm still gonna keep Juice Me. Uh, it actually does, it actually does um, give like quite a bit of juice. So in the event that I only need to juice up one person, I could just do that. Tickle! I didn't realize how broken this could be. All attacks will hit in the heart. And then Ricochet, you know, good old Ricochet. And then for Hero, Cook, pretty standard. Snack time, pretty standard. Tea time, not gonna lie, Juice Me is much better in my opinion than Tea Time, but there just really wasn't anything else that I could really give to Hero without one costing a shit ton of juice. 
and two actually being useful for him and homemade jam you know that's why he's that's why he's the beefiest guy uh in the event that you know we're we're, we're getting screwed we're getting screwed over and whatnot he, he's gonna be the one who's gonna be alive he's gonna be the one who's giving out a gem to everyone but of course, it's not like I'm going to be getting rid of my life champ. Anyways, let me show you this broken strat that I got. Hello, bear. Do you want to play? <laughs> Alright, so we gotta stare at him. Reduces all stats, reduces attack, defense, and speed. And Aubrey is gonna do last resort. And, uh, tickle. We're gonna tickle him. And then Hero, well, he's not really gonna do anything. Because this guy's gonna be dead in one shot. So, we tickle him. He lets his guard down. Stare, all of his stats go down, and come on, Aubrey. <laughs> oh. Now I know what you might be thinking, but she's toast, you know? She she's dead. What of it now? Well, considering that everyone's pretty much a max fucking level, it doesn't I Point in time, it doesn't really matter if I win with her dead or whatnot. As long as she gets the job done, it's worth it in my in my opinion. But yeah, that, that, that's basically what I've been doing. Uh, I don't really have anything else to do other than possibly go through Otherworld and check out uh the the lakes and uh what was the other thing? Oh yeah, I need to figure out what was behind that that golden door or whatnot it's probably the same thing but you know what it's worth it it's worth a shot to look into you know when i was changing all the skills for everyone i just remembered that um i kept pep talk and annoy for aubrey and kel but i didn't keep sad poem for amori and that's just the sole fact that i just have not found a reason to make anyone sad it's just i don't know just making people sad is just kind of it's just kind of pointless, kind of lame. I mean, I guess at this point in time, I could just make people more people more sad. But come on now. Come on. I at least want the clams. <laughs> I at least want the clams. Oh, would you look at that? It's the exact same place. It's just a club. It's just a club every time we go over here. Answer fruit juice to miners. What's up, my guy? Don't tell anyone I said this, but... It's tough being a space pirate. Well, I don't know about you, my G, but, you know, spa space pirates seem kind of cool, you know? I think Kel can agree with that. Everyone gained five juice! Let's go! Maybe it is in my best interest to go through all of these. But the question is now, where was the other ones? Because I completely forgot where they were. Oh, would you look at that? It's Ems. Well, hello there, hero. Hi, Ems. Are you doing well? I'm doing okay. Hoagie sent me here to the couch for timeout. Huh? You're in timeout? What did you do? Nothing. I just tried eating the tables over there. What? You tried eating the tables? You can do that? Oh, I see. Uh, the tables are made out of bread. Oh, Ems. That also reminds me, I- Hold on there, buddy. Hold on there, buddy. He's just gone now. Ah, oh, I have to fight one of you, one of y'all. Well, considering that I can just heal up right next, right next door, you know, fuck it. You know, let's have some fun. Why not? You know, I like seeing big numbers on my, on my screen. Big numbers that I cause, not that the enemy causes. <coughs> <laughs> that that is going to be just my my plan for every single red ribbon that's just gonna be my plan for every single person from now on uh for every single boss battle sorry every single boss battle just red ribbon defense plus five attack increases with more energy that's not bad actually but mm, i don't know i suppose i could give it a hero Actually, that is a great idea. I could give it a hero. Yes, I'd be losing five. I I would be losing five defense, but 
Hero is kind of beefy already, you know? 95 defense, 74 defense for Kel, 70 defense for Aubrey, and 78 for Amori. I think I could probably take the red ribbon because God knows that Hero needs the attack as well. God knows that he needs it. Yes, every single time there's going to be a boss, I'm just going I'm just going to do that strat right away. If it doesn't work well, I have homemade jam. And not gonna lie, I am pretty sauced up, so... It's not like I think I'll have any trouble whatsoever. If I'm being realistically honest here. Aha! Here it is! I've been trying to find this for ages! Oh, what's good, Gator Guy? This atmosphere is, here is top-notch. I bet Ruben makes some good fruit juice. Me and Hoagie are, our own, are the owners of this joint. He's the muscle, and I'm the muscle. Cool, two muscles. <laughs> two guns, two muscles. <laughs> Let's go, everyone gain five juice. Let's go. I still have no clue when, what, what the orange oasis is really for, if I'm being completely honest. Like, I've been through the entirety of it, or I guess except this place again. And like, I'm sorry, but... What the fuck am I supposed to do here? Like, what do I do with that guy? Do I help him? How do I help him? I also don't have an idea of what this ancient code is. Wait a minute. Oh, would you look at that? I got it. The ancient code that I managed to dig up from freaking dinos digs. That's what I had to do. That's what I had to do. Well, what do I do from here? Hello? Whoa, I didn't know there was a ladder there. Do not touch. Touch. Do you want to poke the big toast? Yes, I would like to poke the big toast. Oh. 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 My toast. Oh no. Now I've done it. Where the hell am I? <laughs> Ew! What is all this? This... This is all-purpose flour. Achoo! Ugh! My nose is all itchy! Well... Cool, I get- I- We're just... Filled to the brim with flour now, aren't we? Now where do we ha- Where the hell do we go from here? Hello? Stop right there, no gooders! Can't y'all read directions? Y'all should be ashamed of yourselves. My family and I have been guarding this crypt's treasure for generations. But guarding ain't easy because of people like you. I may be old and frail, and my eyesight may not be so good, and I may be the only one left. But I spent a lifetime doing this, and I've gotten real good at guarding, I reckon. I can't even remember what I'm guarding, but it's probably whatever's hidden in that important looking safe in the left corner of the room. Anyway, I'm gonna have to ask y'all to leave peacefully. Being an actual mole and all, I can dig my way out of here in three seconds flat. There ain't nothing special about this place. So how about I save you some trouble and get you out of here? No. You want to stay and enjoy the place? Alright, if you insist. Feel free to look around and all. This summoning circle may be old, but it still works like a charm. But no funny business, or else. Oh, funny business, you say? Don't you even think about opening that safe! There's definitely no combination or anything like that around these parts. The perfect spot for a sacrifice? Uh... Combination? Oh man... What kind of combination? There's a loaf? Spaghetti? Jam, cookies, oatmeal cookies, the forest bunny, 
and a stray cat. I have no clue where I got myself into. Is there anything else that the secret code told me to do? That's snacks. That's the wrong one. Change list. Ancient code. No. There's literally nothing else. Um. I have no clue. Alright, think, 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 think. Place for a sacrifice, right? So, and this is bread, right? Let's pick up. Wait a minute! Seven, two, oh! One, nine, and nine. Alright. Seven, two, zero, one, nine, six, nine. I got it! I got it! A recipe for disaster? Recipe for disaster ingredient, the mole. Alright buddy, I'm sorry. What in tarnation? Sorry, buddy. I need to know what's going on. A portal has been opened. All right. What do we have over here? What is this portal? Where am I going? What have I done? I will never not be paranoid of how loud these dogs are barking. Oh. Uh, ooh. You're joking me, right? There's no shot. Ha! Loser! Loser! You thought! Wait a minute. Where's my party? <laughs> Don't tell me it's them. I have my stuff, right? Yeah, I do. There you go, Aubrey. Oh, Mori! You saved me! Thank you. I thought I was toast for sure. No, 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 no. I will never let my friends become toast. Oh, uh, hey guys, what I miss? Nothing much, nothing much. There we go. Ugh. Welcome back, hero. How are you feeling? I feel dizzy. Whoa, hey, where are we? I don't know. Maybe a place where all abandoned toast goes. Well, we sure as heck aren't toast anymore. Uh, let's for let's hurry and find a way out of here. Well, glad gl glad glad we have a plan, hero. Unfortunately, I'm going to leave it off for there. If you liked the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Memento Mori and whatnot. My name is Pixel Up, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Take care, everybody.